This morning I have engaged with both the Tonish Jessai McCovney and with the new British Secretary of State, Karen Bradley. And I have confirmed to them that Sinn Féin are prepared to enter into a time-limited, short, intensive talks process, which we'll see rolled out over the course of the next two weeks. For our part, we've always been determined to make these institutions work, but we also know the basis in which they need to work, and that is that they need to deliver for all citizens. They'll only have the confidence of the public if they serve everyone equally. So over the course of the next two weeks, that will be the test of whether or not the British government and the DUP endorse or embrace, if you like, the principles on which these institutions need to be re-established. I also took the opportunity this morning to raise directly with the Secretary of State the issue of the leaked boundary proposals which we saw yesterday. Clearly there are questions to be answered and clearly there is a danger uh, what we've seen leaked is the fact that it points very much to gerrymandering so there are a lot more uh, answers required in relation to that. Karen Bradley might be a new Secretary of State but the British Government clearly are not impartial when it comes to these negotiations and have you seen throughout the course of last year they're repeatedly pandering to the DUP on certain issues so they can't be an honest broker. What we need to see is the two governments as co-guarantors working together, establishing these talks and trying to deliver an outcome that benefits everybody and that remains our position. Sinn Féin, Gwananis, Carta Agus Eintas Naharan, Equality, Rights and Irish Unity.